tests required. Doctor examines physically with a stethoscope to hear a clicking sound which may indicate the tightening of the valve leaflets. He will also see if there is a murmur which may indicate a leakage of blood because of the valve opening. Chest X-ray is done to study the size and shape of the heart and see whether there is anything that indicates a problem. In an electrocardiogram (ECG), electrodes are attached to the patient's skin and the electrical impulses produced by the heart are measured. Echocardiography can detect whether the valves are infected. This procedure is used to evaluate the prolapse and mitral regurgitation and its effects on the ventricle muscles. The patient will carry a holter monitor which continuously records the heart rhythms. The recording takes place for a day, but sometimes the patient will have to wear a recorder for 2 weeks whenever they feel a heart palpitation. Cardiac catheterization is done through catheters which are inserted into the blood vessels this dye then appears on x-ray images doctors can use this information to see how the heart heart valves and blood flow is functioning and whether there is any leakage the patient's heart is recorded while they exercise usually on a treadmill this test will show any abnormal heart rhythms that occur while the patient is exercising